Can we lift up our hands? Rise on your feet, everybody, wherever you are, rise on your feet. Let's give Jesus praise. Come on, let's give Jesus praise in that spirit of worship. Lift up your hands to Jesus. Let's honor him tonight. Come on, pray in the Holy Ghost. Can we bring tongues in this house? We are spiritual people. The Bible says, out of our belly shall flow rivers of living water. Come on, come on, lift up your sound and pray in tongues. Pray in tongues. Eva Sapro Veratas Bible says he that spray tongues, he that speaketh in tongues, speaketh unto God and speaketh not unto man. How be it is speaketh mysteries. Father, we have come tonight to worship. We have come tonight to bless you. We have come tonight to praise you. We have come tonight to say thank you. There is none only like the Lord. Neither is there an enemy of like him. Give him praise, give him worship tonight. Can you pray in tongues in the next 30 seconds? tonight to hallow his name we have come tonight to honor him in the life of our father in the lord for another year the lord bless you it is our year of global relevance courts love of christ chapel international ministries to all our facebook audience we love you we celebrate you every facebook audience everyone we are evangelists by ordination and by the anointing praise god Hallelujah. so please do well to like comment and share this broadcast a million times as you're watching me right now, punch the like button, comment your heart. You can share a hundred times, share a million times, so that those who are not live with us can have opportunity to rewatch this broadcast by the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ. If you are watching via YouTube, Mercy Monday TV is the channel. Please do well to subscribe if today is your first time so that you can get notified ASAP whenever we are live on this channel. All Facebook, if as YouTube audience, you are doing well but we can do better we have a quest to get to 200,000 subscribers before june 2024 the bible says he called those things that be not as though they were tonight is special so please i beg you type out your prayer request in the comment section our father and the lord instructed from day one of this meeting that we should write out five prayer requests we trust god that his mercies alone can give to us and because this month is special to us marking the birth month of our father and the lord so this is what we are doing. We are giving worship on behalf of our Father and Lord. So please type it in the comment section or you can bring out your journal. Write out five prayer requests. You trust God that only his mercies can give to you. And as you're writing them, the mercies of the Lord will bring them to manifestation in the name of Jesus. Amen. And also please tell us the country you are connected from. I'm watching from UK, from America, from France, from Dublin, from Dubai, 
from Canada, from Toronto, Intermini, in Jambi, type it, and watch it from Lagos, and no go cross over by Esa, Kaduna, Castina, wherever. So we can know where and where our families are connected all over the globe. And also, please, if you are not following our Father and the Lord on Instagram, if you are a son and a daughter of the prophet, you will follow. Go to his Instagram handle right now. Follow, punch the follow button so you can get updated about the ministry and also updated about every other outreach movement we have in 2024. Praise God. We are live on Mixelow. Mixelow is an audio radio where you can hear us expressly. Perhaps you are busy, you are in your office, you are driving, or you are in your kitchen cooking something, something. Please download Mercy Mandate. You know, just download your Mixelow, search it up on Play Store, and check out Mercy Mandate. You'll catch us live and direct. We are live on Spotify. We have two dimensions on Spotify. Messy Mandate English and Messy Mandate Yoruba. It's more in the week. If you don't understand English, studio. Wow. Wow. We have our app. We have our website, www.loccim.org. I repeat, www.loccim.org. And also, you can get our daily devotional. Just check our website. You'll catch it there live and direct. The information is staying to your screen. Please do well to go through them for your convenience and also for your blessing by the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ. Tonight promises to be prophetic and life transforming. Don't go anywhere. Stay glued to your screen. Invite friends and families, including enemies. Let it be part of what the Lord is doing tonight. It is our culture to give God praise. To tell him thank you for yesterday. Thank you for today. You understand. In fact, today we are doing a lot of thanksgiving, a lot of worship. And like I said, my co-ministers are around. They will be coming back to back. We'll be singing, we'll be worshiping, and also we'll be reciting the Psalms unto God on behalf of our Father and the Lord. But first and foremost, please, we are going to be inviting our pastor, Pastor Lumidi Komolafe, to come to take a special prayer in Psalm. We are going to be reading Psalm 136 from verse 1 to the end. So we are going to be doing it together. It will take verse 1 and we'll take verse 2 simultaneously like that. Can we celebrate and welcome Pastor Lumidi Komolafe? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Celebrate Jesus in this house. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, celebrate, celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can we quickly open our Bible to Psalm 136? It's a good thing to give thanks to the Lord. It's a privilege to be in the house tonight. Give thanks for what God is doing. And I know someone here tonight. The Lord will set to your case in the name of Jesus. I say, God will set to your case in the name of Jesus. Amen. Bible says, Jesus stood on the last day. Said, Is there anyone that is texted? Let him come and drink. For as many that are texted tonight, God will quench your text in the name of Jesus. Amen. Psalm 136. I read verse 1, then you read verse 2. Are we ready? God bless you as we go in Jesus' name. Amen. Oh, we'll give thanks unto the Lord for his good, for his mercy, and endures forever. Oh, we'll give thanks unto, unto the, the God of God. For his mercy endures forever. Oh, give thanks to the Lord of Lord for his mercy endures forever. He does great wonders for his mercy endures forever. To him that by wisdom made the heavens for his mercy endures forever. You are in verse 6 now. To him that set the head above the waters for his mercy endures forever. To him that made great things for his mercy endures forever. Verse 8 now. The moon, the star, to rule by night for his mercy and deals forever. We can come and up better. Verse 10, to him that smote Egypt in their firstborn for his mercy and deals forever. And brought out Israel from among them for... To him that smote Egypt for their, and their firstborn for his mercy and deals forever. Verse 11 and, and brought out Israel from among them for his mercies and deals forever. Verse 13 and to him which divide the Red Sea into parts for his mercies and deals forever. But over true Pharaoh and his host in the Red Sea for his mercies and deals forever. To him who smote great kings for his mercy and deals forever. Verse 19, I sound king of the Amorite for his mercy and deals forever. And gave their land for an heritage for his mercy and deals forever. 
who remembered us in our lowest state for his mercy and yours forever. Who give food to all fresh for his mercy and yours forever. We'll read the last one together. Everybody, everybody, we go now together. The last one. I will ready. One, two, three, go. Oh, give thanks unto the God of heaven for his mercies. Please, can we go one more time? Can we go one more time? That last verse. Let's go one more time. Oh, give thanks unto the God of heaven for his mercies and yours forever. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Praise God wherever Hallelujah. you are. Just Hallelujah. wave your hands to Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. Father, we bless your name. Come on, lift your voice to Jesus wherever you are, even though you are glad and happy. Hallelujah. What a mighty God we serve. What a mighty God we serve. Hallelujah. Heaven and earth are done. Come and lift your voice to Jesus. Angels bow before you. What a mighty God we serve. All alone, I let down. I we pay a show. Everybody, lift your voice. All alone, oh boy. They say, oh, boy, I want to see Baba. See what the Lord has done. Can you see what the Lord has done? Everybody sing what we heard. Has come to pass. See what. the Lord has done over the life of our Father. See what the Lord has done. What we've waited for has come to pass. See what the Lord has done. Hallelujah. Make a joyful noise to the Lord. Jam your hands together for Jesus. It is better celebration. Tori Prophet Peter, Adenin Yolo Paroku, La Shenjo. La Shenjo ni waju alonu majemu o Oh, 
Give him praise. Lord, I say thank you. Lord, we say thank you. Lord, we say big thanks to you. Lord, we say thank you. Blessed be your name, O Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. In Jesus' name we worship. Oh, in Jesus' name we worship. The Bible says, if the Lord has not been on our side, listen to me, if God has not been on the side of a servant, we will be talking of another thing today. I want to appreciate the defense of God, the backings of God over his life, over the family, the, in fact, also over mama, the, 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 our mother in the house. We are going to appreciate God for her also, appreciate God for all the children, the glorious children the Lord has bless the family with we want to appreciate it if the Lord has not been on our side and the Bible says our soul escaped as a ball from the snare of the fowler the snare got broken oh many a times the snare got broken concerning this great servant of God the enemy, the enemy does not want him to be what he is today the enemy does not want, they did not want him to, to get to this stage. He has been a blessing to the global world. Say thank you, Jesus, thank you, Jesus. for keeping your servant, for, keeping your for servant. protecting him, for, for preserving him, and for creating resources to fulfill destiny. To fulfill Go ahead and appreciate the Lord. Lord Give him praise. Him. Give him praise. Jesus. Give him praise. Thank Give him praise. Jesus. Worship him. Jesus. Worship the majesty of God. Jesus. Worship the majesty of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, we worship. Amen. If the Lord has not built the house, it is not by his power, not by his might, it is by the mercy of God. Shout loud and clear. God of mercy. God of mercy. We worship you today. We worship you today. On behalf of your servant. Of your go ahead. Go ahead and worship the God of mercy. The one that kept his servant alive. God of mercy. We worship. We worship you. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, In Jesus. Jesus' name we worship. Amen. Shout loud and clear. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah. Lift up your hands wherever you may be. The life giver will say thank you. The sustainer will say thank you. The Lord that has been there for him, we say thank you. The God that has been merciful unto us, we say thank you. Daddy, we just want to return all adoration unto you. Be exalted forever in Jesus' name. Amen. In me, you So, Lord, look by the shell for me. Oh, by your leshell. In me, you I want to pet that up for big back by and away a socket by. Hey, Yoro, hey, Yoro, ha, 
I have come to adore you. More wale for a warrior, Sad Arugo. More wale for you. Will Arugo lie lie? More wale for Arugo job about me. Oh, Arugo job. So, I worry back. A key or lore. A key or lore. A bomb. A key or lore. Lo duro ni wa 
in my sorrow.
here shout hallelujah. hallelujah. If you are going to partake in the wine that is God is serving here, shout hallelujah. hallelujah. If you are not going to return empty-handed tonight, shout hallelujah. 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 We want to thank God for the life of our Father. We will be taking it from Psalm 19, from verse 1 to 6. We will be praying from verse 4. We want to pray and thank God for the expansion of the church globally. Especially that this year is our year of global relevance. Psalm 19, from verse 1 to 6, we emphasize on verse 4. The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament showeth forth his handiwork. Yes, day unto day uttereth speech, and night unto night showeth forth knowledge. Verse 3. There is There's no speech nor language. language. Where yeah, their God. voice, can you see, not is heard. not heard. Aha. You see the verse 4? Their line it's is going out throughout all the yes. earth. And their words to the, to the end, end of, of the world. world. That is where we want to appreciate God. God has taken this ministry, the line, the words, the person, and the presence of God, what they are doing in this ministry from wherever they start to where the whole world is watching, want to say, Father, we appreciate you for making it possible, for giving the line that go out throughout the world, for giving the line that go out for the end of the world, for people in every language and every tongue that hear and bear witness to this day that we are celebrating. We want to say, Father, thank you for expanding your church globally. Let's put hands together for Jesus. Hallelujah. First of all, thank God for the grace, thank God for the word, Thank God for the determination. Thank God for the resources. Thank God for the manpower. Thank God for the people. Let's open our mouth and begin to appreciate God. Let's begin to appreciate God. Let's begin to appreciate God. Thank you from the corner where he started to the corner where he's going. Globally, from local to global, from nation to international, from one continent to other continent, for the people that are here and they told another people, from the people that are here and they tell another people, for the people that believe and for the testimony. Thank God for what this year is doing. Thank God for giving them a line that go out throughout the world. Thank God for giving them a voice that is going to the end of the world. We appreciate you. We celebrate you. We appreciate you. We celebrate you. We celebrate you. We in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's thank God for the anointing of expansion that is anointed the servants of God upon the ministry. Father, we thank you for the anointing of expansion. Prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for the anointing of expansion. Uh, he told Ezekiel that I will measure a thousand for you. When you worship, when you walk into that water, it will be on the ankle. Another one thousand, it will be in your loins. Another one thousand, it will be in your breast. Another one thousand, it will be a river you cannot sweep finish. Holy Spirit, we thank you for the anointing of expansion upon the servant of God. For the anointing of the expansion upon the servant of God. In, oh, Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. For you are good. For you are great. For your word. For your promise. In Jesus' name, we pray. We are going to thank God once again for the promise that has come to pass. Let's put hands together for that. Hallelujah. Let's celebrate God for that. God has Thank given you, many Jesus. promise. Many of it have not come to pass. Many of it may not even come to pass. But this one has come to pass. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you for this promise that has come to pass. Prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. We celebrate you for the promise that you promised your servant. When the corner, when he was praying in the bush, when he was praying in the night, when he was praying in the one corner, and you said this world will go to the whole, to the whole world. Even as small as they were, yet your word has come to pass. You have come to fulfill this word. You say this promise is unto you and to your children and to the children, children, and to as many as God will call. Father, we thank you for this word. Father, we thank you for this word. Father, we thank you for the promise that has come to pass. Father, we thank you for the promise that has come to pass. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Lastly, we are going to thank God for the people that supported the vision, that are flowing with the vision, that the wings of the vision is carrying, and are glorified with the vision. If you are mentioning our Father, you will be surprised that they will mention some people behind him. Father, we thank you for the people that are flowing with the relevance of this mission. Prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, Father Lord, Lord, we Jesus, we thank you for the people that are flowing with the relevance of this mission. We thank you, we thank you. We thank you for the people that are relevant with the vision and the glory that follow them. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are not shouting, we are saying. Let's rise to our feet and shout. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our God is awesome. 
Shall we just lift up our hands and begin to appreciate our maker tonight? Let's tell him, Daddy, we thank you. Daddy, we love you. Daddy, we appreciate you. We give you all the glory. Be lifted, be lifted, be lifted, be lifted, be lifted. Hallelujah. Let's tell him, Daddy, you are worthy. You are worthy. Thank you, faithful Father. Thank you, Jesus. Go, go, I sugar. Hungerly. Jesus, thank you, Jesus. 
Praise ye the Lord, praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him in the firmament of his power. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him with the sound of the trumpet. Praise him with the psaltery and harp. Praise him with the timbrel and dance. Praise him with stringed instruments and organs. Praise him upon the loud cymbals. Praise him upon the high sounding cymbals. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. Praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Father, we bless your name. Hallelujah. Emmanuel, we hail thee. The King of glory. The mighty man of war. Jago, Jago. Olu, Shago, Fone. Olu, Woso. Somebody celebrates him this morning. Hallelujah. Wave your hands to him. Our healer. The great comforter. Thank you, Jesus. Olu, Pese. We bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah.
Hallelujah. And if he shows praise the Lord, and that is the sound of the If you are here celebrating with my papa, stand up and praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise him again. Hallelujah. Thank you. Bible to the book of Sam. Hallelujah. 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 The excitement is very high. I tell you, we have to open our book after our Bible to the book of Psalm 103. They are just taking the two verses. Psalm uh, verse 2 and 3. It says, praise the Lord, my soul, and forget not all his benefits. Who forgives us all your sins and heals all your diseases. Praise God. Hallelujah. My beloved, you know, the call of Papa Richard in the local of school is healing. Yes. I tell you, except you don't know the trend. Papa will tell you. Well, what is there in the power of man to the power of anointing or in the power of water? I forget the communion and the body of Christ. So in that, we don't have any more sin to do tonight. Hallelujah. So thank God, God of mercy, Hallelujah. that has called Papa, that is making him to speak. Even without seeing him, you are healed. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hearing Papa's voice is enough for me. Glory. Seeing him is more than enough. Hallelujah. Touching him, of course. Hallelujah. Every you know, the God has called him. He has given him that oil to heal people. Hallelujah. I can say it. I'm more than a testifier. Yes. And a lot of people, because I know Papa. Are testifying. Glory. So we don't have any more sin to tell God this night, this morning, than to tell God, say after me, dear Father, dear Father, we thank you for blessing our Papa. We thank you for blessing our Papa. What is his name? Peter. 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 With good health. With good health and strength. And strength. You know, Papa, nobody can walk like him. Yes. You can't be like Papa. Yes. We know the grace he has. Sure. Papa doesn't sleep. I don't know how he record. Money prayer, the whole world gets it. We have to, it can only be God. Hallelujah. It can only be God's anointing. So, my beloved, we have to get up. Do as you like to thank God for his life. Yes. For the strength. Hallelujah. And yes. for the good health. Glory. And we thank him for he's going to Papa, we celebrate 90, yeah. 100, yeah. 140, yeah. Uh, to fulfill that work God has given to him. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Prayers. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I bless you. Thank you for the good health and strength. Thank you for the good health and strength. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, I bless you for the good health and strength. Lord, I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. I bless you for the good health and strength. In God's vineyard, with the call God has given him, you know that a lot of black people are not happy. So we need to put Papa's health in God's hands. That, yes, we know God has given him this grace. But we continue to strengthen him. Amen. We continue to give him that new anointing, Amen. that better glory, Amen. Uh, that fresh oil Amen. that we surpass all evil doers. That is vibrating us. Amen. He himself is getting more power. Amen. He's getting charged. That's for the glory of God. Amen. Prayers. Father, in the name of Jesus. 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 Father, in
God is good. All the time. And all the time. The Lord God is good. good. If you know you are here to celebrate, there's a saying that if you don't celebrate grace, you cannot be celebrated. So if I'm here to celebrate grace, I want you to leave your, lift your hands, lift your voice, lift your heart. We are not here to come and showcase ourselves. We are here to tap from grace. <laughs> Can you begin to call God beautiful names? Can you begin to call God beautiful names? Somebody is still out. If you are here, you are not here to come and show how you can dance, but to receive from God. Can you sing a song to God? Sing a song to God. <laughs> Jehovah Jireh. Can you sing that song? Somebody's not singing that song. Give us Somebody sing that song to Jesus. Somebody sing that song to Jesus. Somebody's not singing.
and the keyboard just play just let's worship go with our silence thank you father can you just bow your head bow your heart before god let's worship go with our silence in this house Just worship him with your silence. Come on. this night. We join the cherubims and the seraphims to give him worship. Oh, and it's only Kulai Lai. Obato Mo Kulati Bere. Along to Pala Fang Oku. He that was, that is, and is to come. The one who never dies. We have come to Mount Zion to the innumerable company of angels. We worship you, Majesty, O oh God. We bless your name, O oh God. Thank you, Father. So kufu mi Adina ka zwata Jeki leje Olo 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 Waye Yuani yi Ato Peye Bala broko swata, bawola bati. Somebody heart and mind is not here.
If you are not here, you are on a long thing. But I believe there is no distance in the realm of the spirit. Can somebody shout glory to God? Hallelujah. Wow, wow, wow. You know, I can imagine, praise God. I can imagine how heaven looks like. And this is what we will do internally. We will keep dancing. We will keep worshiping. 
The Bible says, and they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by their words of testimony. Even scripture confirms it that the testimony of Jesus is the spirit of prophecy. We want to thank God for the life of our Father and Lord. Our Father and Lord has helped him till this moment. Now, we want to take testimonies from our Father and distinguished, distinguished guest, and missed us this morning. Please welcome and celebrate with me, Olu of Makogi. Celebrate. With all humility of heart, I bring a bond. Thank you, sir. Hallelujah. 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 Baba, firstly, happy birthday to you, sir. You know me, I'm so happy to be here this night. To read Baba Je Baba Dada. Me only sorrow, Baba Tom. Honestly, we are going to be able to get the money. But we are going to be able to get My name is not my surprise, Baba. No, Baba, I'm not going to be able to get In fact, I have the opportunity to get the money. I have the pastor. Obani. In fact, the one sorrow, Baba, O sorrow, Baba, Mude to Lanu Lake, a meeting of Sumo Baba, me to Mo Baba, to her. A jacket to perform. I'm so happy to have Baba in this Makogi. I always say it. We pay. Opportunity Lani Latin Nero Babai Nibi because always me him more content my song Baba because me Tiri Mushin Wa me Tiri Pastor Pi Baba Ujisha alone be Baba Baba Okin soon. Ah, always prayer. Cherry, Agbara alone. Imisi alone. Eniti alone. Fe, ayo fe alone ni Baba to joko. I always say it. We pray. I'm a Muslim. But mutu fen on lorun kuko la tarababay. Baba ti mu mi jino. Baba ni a sheti on lorun. Lord, I want to bomb when you test what you need to buy. I'm here alone on time, really. I ain't feeling silly, Lord God. I want to bomb my person. I wish you long life and prosperity. Any console, let me be. I'm a baba, but she's 90. I'm a one, she's 100. I'm a one, she's 110. I have a one she won twenty. Amen. To party the one fifty. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, we want to call one of our father too. We always go to fourteen mountain together, and it drives like. <laughs> I want to call Prince Adewumi to come and. Testify. <laughs> P. 
praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bye bye. Congratulations, sir. Happy birthday to you, sir. So, you know me do that. Mo Baba. That of Baba wa Elijah Lufemi Akadi. This is Lion of Judah. In 2005. Mo Baba. On Timo, we develop interest in Numo. Ubo Amani showed or Connie. Ni Lion of Judah. Osman me a co. Nibba Tiba Bafi Walai. Could see, could you see be? Tiba Baba wa. On my minister, don't know to Yato. To Bubba wa count out the book way. Babolo or Kumbo. Could see what you're a watu. Ama make sure you pay a one be. Tori, I won't roll gin lay. Two common. See, I'm Bossiti. At a one drat on my pay. Tamangba. O je ki gugu wa ke ani fe won nigba to tun di pe atun lo si gege bi awon to soro siwaju so so nigba to tun di pe atun lo si jerusalem awon ati baba ke ade mo wa ninu team yen na nigba na ati eh president ashifa is show for ora so passage room wa hotel tawa asodi ori oke ni zero pe baba Local ones, but one want my tabat and bone at my garden in room one at my bus passage. Bobo at my bad rat did that gin. So Bobo always so Bobo wa la my jeque life a man transformation. So Ojaki Monifesi Baba, Latima tell you at your polo power. See our last lion of Judah. Not to this stage you come, Baba. I can't do for an hour go. I don't know. administration to to go to buy money if any power to 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 So, I'm Baba. Coffee, I the benefit more Latin share on share one. So, congratulations. I want to call our father to son all the way from America. Come and say something about Papa. <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I I would say that um, I had an encounter with God through his vessel. God has used him exceptionally the healing power of God exceptionally through this vessel of honor. I cannot but say this is my Rehoboth. We need to keep him up, lifting up in prayers just like Kabiesi said we benefit from his labor and therefore we must as a duty lift him up in all our prayers I congratulate you sir a, a happy birthday heartfelt appreciation of the work of God that you do tirelessly. As a matter of fact, everybody marvels at the grace that God has bestowed on you because 
I do not know. When I check my phone, you are online. I go to sleep for a few hours, you are still online. <laughs> then I ask, this is supernatural. Hallelujah. More anointing, sir. Amen. More glory. Amen. The Lord that you serve, I happen to be um, a Latin student. The Lord that you serve would bless you Amen. beyond all mortals Amen. in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. He would bless you and therefore he must bless the descendant of Eve that is on your left. Amen. Because it is not by accident that her name is Grace. That is the blessing of God. Can we do without grace? So Lord would extend your unity. Amen. And everything, every every living thing that has come out of your loins Amen. in the name of our Lord Jesus Amen. Christ. This ministry, we have just seen the beginning. Amen. It is just the beginning. Amen. God would spare our lives. Amen. To flow and fly yeah. with me. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen. We're moving to want to worship God again. And then we're going to call uh, Bishop and uh, Dr. Shualali. It's not going to be the format we have been using before. It's a special format tonight. Because it's a night of celebration. Uh, later, we'll now call uh, our mommy to come and talk and uh, papa. Uh, people in diaspora, people that are watching us, send your congratulatory message to our YouTube. Send it, we'll print it out, and we'll read it before we go tonight. Samish, what to you? Oh, be lifted up over Lord of God. Everybody, we and Isaiah chapter 6 verse 1 the Bible says in the year that Uzziah died I saw the Lord a seraphim flew to another seraphim and said holy is the Lord the Bible records that they have six wings they used two to fly they used two to cover their face and two to cover their feet oh believe that Everybody, we lay a salabara pie like a rapa sambara diketos. Revelation chapter one. John said, When I saw him, I fell as a dead man. Oh, believe me. Can you bow everybody's head? Psalm 114. When Israel went out of Egypt, the house of Jacob from a strange language, Judah became God's sanctuary and Israel is dominion. The sea saw it and fled. Jordan was driven back. 
the mountains keep like rams before him and the little hills like lambs before him what ail thee O see that thou fleddest and thou jot down that thou was driven back ye mountains that skip like rams and ye little hills like lambs uh, tremble O earth at the presence of the lord at the presence of the god of adeni yoloparaku who caused the rock to be a spring of water and a flint a fountain water oh believe the Only the strings. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Who is that? And I won't put it up here. Simage. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, Fearful embrace. Always to be in wonder's eye. I am open my mouth. I am alone. There is no time, there is no time. Bang te zumba, abaka di sube la hada. Emi mi mo e sheo. Emi awa woli. Enyi kuku la dara wa. Asha. Emi mi mo e sheo. Listen,
you no one can lift you. Thank you, Jesus. My helper, oh. my helper, oh. my helper. Somebody raise your sounds. Come on. Invite Dr. Shualali to come and give his birthday message to Papa. Then I will call Bishop, the best man of Papa. <laughs> Once again, I want us to celebrate the Lord's message, okay? Uh, I want to thank the Lord. First and foremost, let me say happy birthday, sir. Happy birthday, man. The Lord will strengthen you. More grace, more strength. Honor, Amen. divine presence, Amen. greater height, Amen. greater impact. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I want to celebrate our mommy too. The Lord will honor you. Amen. And things will work out as expected. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Incidentally, this morning, our focus is on giving. Mercy through giving. Power of giving. Benefits of giving. Reasons for giving, principles of giving, purpose of giving. And I want to first of all start by introducing this, that living without giving is dying without knowing. Living without giving is dying without knowing. Let me say it again. The only way to live is to give. That you are the best preacher and poor giver does not give you a delightful life. Preaching is a skill. Giving is a dream. Anybody can preach, but very few people can give. Because giving is like shedding your blood. Giving is a sacrifice. That is why Living is ungiving. And that is why I'm encouraging everybody, particularly all over the world, under the influence of my voice, that be encouraged. That the best way to live is to give. Even when God himself wanted the old world back to him, he gave his only son. So if he did not violate the principle of giving, then where are we playing it down? Why can't we raise the voice where he has spoken so loudly? The moment there is no seed sowing, then there will never be any harvest. And that is the principle. If you expect harvest, you must sow seed. In so many ways, I can, I can go through this dimension of giving. But particularly, I want to major only on one part. And I'm saying this to all seated here. I'm also saying this to all that are hearing all over the world. One singular statement that is so common that I've heard frequently, more often than not in this place, when Kabiesi came out and he said a lot about the sacrifice of our father. And when our father from US too came out and he used the word, he had extensively labored and he's still laboring. And that oftentimes he kept asking himself while he will be sleeping, he will be prophet will be online. And by the time he's kicking back, he will still find that the prophet is online. Then, so many things were coming to my mind. That I should rechannel this giving towards a particular verse that if you can give a cup of cold water to this one in my name, you won't lose your reward. Could it be that Jesus knew that there could be certain of such that he will call who will labor so hard, labor so deep, labor so well, and we might take for granted the hard work. No wonder he said, even there is given to this, given to that. 
But if you will honor this one, if you do your giving and you give to this one a cup of cold water, you will not lose your reward. Galatians chapter 6 verse 6. I love that one very well. We can give that. I'm going to read few and then my bishop will come. Let him that is taught in the world communicate unto him that teacheth in all good things. I'm deliberately reading the scripture so that anything we want to do now, you will find out that we have the source from God's word. Galatians chapter 6. Let him that is taught in the world Communicate unto his teacher in all things good things. If we have so much benefited from the grace of God upon our Father, impact in healing, impact in prayer, impact in the world, laboring every day, laboring every night. And we are saying that we are in the month of giving. And this is his month. I think Galatians chapter 6 verse 6 is ringing a bell. That if you have benefited tremendously from this grace, let us communicate back to him. Let us give back to him. It is not a sin. It is spiritual. It is a right. It carries spiritual blessing. It carries powerful blessing. If you communicate back to your teacher, back to your prophet, in all things, good things. I want you to also turn your Bible to 1 Corinthians chapter 1. 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verses 10 to 11. 1 Corinthians chapter 1, 10 to 11. Now I beseech you, brethren, by the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Um, is it that verse? Give me verse 11. Except we are reading 2 Corinthians. Look at what the scripture is saying there. Let me show you the scripture, what the scripture is saying there. Maybe you fish it out because I want us to read it. That it is a right thing. It is normal. If after you have benefited from us spiritually, then we benefit from your material things. Is it 2 Corinthians? If you can fish it out, please, I want you to flash it and give back to me. That if we have given back to you spiritual things, that it is not sinful if we reap from you material things. It is established. It is the word of God. But I want to show you three powerful things or benefits before we go. I've just read those verses, Galatians chapter 6 verses to show that this is what the scripture is saying. In the book of John chapter 11 verse 2, these are things we should expect when we partake in that exercise. It was that Mary which anointed the Lord with ointment and wiped his feet with her hair. Her brother Lazarus was sick. The first question, why did they differentiate that Mary from other Mary? There must have been so many people bearing Mary. And there must be a need for a Mary that stood out. And what made that Mary to stand out was just because he did what others didn't do. He, she gave. And what did she give? The Bible says she gave the best ointment. She broke it. She poured it on Jesus Christ. She was using her tears as water to wash the feet. And she was using her hair to wipe it off. So when, she, when Jesus heard that the brother was dead four days, the Bible says where he was, he stood up. He said, for whatever is the reason for Lazarus to die, I will go this far to bring him back to life. There could be so many reasons why people may give reasons why they must not give to the prophet. Number one, Judah said, this is a waste. Some people are saying that. Why do you want to give to prophet? It's a waste. Why do you want to sow to prophet? It's a waste. Even what they should give that the Lord is selling them, they will say it is better to sell it and give to the poor. It has not changed. Opinion of people, views of people, perceptions of evil has not changed. What they keep on telling you is God has a way of rewarding his people. God has a way of feeding them. God, and the, Or you will think that the best in your hand belongs to the poor. But I'm saying that this is month of giving. This is week of giving. 
and this is his own week. And this is what I am saying. That that ointment, break it, pour it. Don't sell it to give to the poor. He said, the poor you always have with you. This is another opportunity for God to bless us mightily. See what she did and see how God pay her back. All I'm saying is that one of the benefits of giving is to have back things that were dead, things that were precious to you, things that you were crying over, things bringing grief to you. See what Mary did, see the benefits. If we key into the grace, if you sow into the life, if you identify yourself with what the Lord is doing in the prophet's life, God takes over the responsibility of sorting you out the best way which you can never, never comprehend even in your own imagination. Secondly, the Bible says in the book of Genesis chapter 18 verse 2, when Abraham saw the three men, he perceived that these three men were angels and they were on their way to destroy Sodom and Gomorrah. The Bible says he ran to meet them from the tent door. He bowed himself towards the ground. Look at the next one. The Bible says, look at, he first of all gave them the sir. He said, my Lord, if now I have found favor in your sight, pass not away, I pray thee from your servant. Look at the next one. Let a little water, I pray, be fetched. Let me wash your feet. Then you rest yourself under the tree. Look at the next one. I will fetch a morsel of bread. Then I will comfort your heart after that ye shall pass on. For therefore are you come to your servant. And they said, so do as thou hast said. And look at the next one. And Abraham hastened into the tent unto Sarah and said, Make ready quickly three measures of fine meal, knead it, and make cakes upon the hearth. And the next one. And Abraham ran unto the earth, fetched a calf, tender and good, and he gave it unto a young man, and he hasted to dress it. I want you to see. And he took butter and milk, and the calf which he had dressed, he set it before them. He stood by them under the tree, and they did eat. Look at the next thing. After they had finished eating. See giving. And see what this giving is provoking. After they had eaten, they now said, Where is Sarah your wife? And he said, Behold in the tent. And he said, I will certainly return unto thee according to the time of life. And lo, Sarah your wife shall have a son. And Sarah had it in the tent door which was behind him. Look at the important thing that was done, giving giving. And that was the end of that barrenness. She, he quickly spared. He gave them water. He quickly spared. He fetched a calf. He first of all gave Desha. Hey, be rolling with this one. He said, give them cake first. After they had finished eating the cake, then how we bring the calf that is young and that is the best. Let them eat. And the angels ate. And after they said, now that you have given unto us, we want to give back to you what man cannot give you. There is power in giving beyond you. And I'm saying there is much more when you honor his servants. The Bible says, count them of double honor who labor heavily in God's world. There is power when you give to prophets. There is power. There are benefits. Let me read one more. Two more and then. Second Kings chapter 4. Look at verses 8 to 16. I'm saying specifically, I'm not saying give to the poor. I'm not saying give to the orphan. I'm not saying give to the widow. That could be good. That is good. That is okay. But I'm particularly saying that this giving all over the world, wherever you are, and you have benefited from the grace, either from radio, either from WhatsApp, either from television, either from Facebook, either from Instagram, in whatever channel that the Lord has used this grace of our prophet to speak to your life, encouragement, blessing, lifting, no longer crying, no longer shedding tears, global dimension. Some of you are having residency. Some of you, you have cars. Some of you, you have children. You see a lot of healing and sicknesses that God has healed and God has dealt with. I don't want you to be like nine that were healed and only one came back to say thank you. Look at this one and then I will read. Second Kings chapter 4, look at four, from verse 8. Second Kings chapter 4 and from verse 8. And it fell on a day that Elisha passed to Shunem, where was a great woman. And she constrained him to eat bread. This was a great woman. And she saw a prophet. 
and she asked him to come and eat bread. And so it was that as often as he passed by, he turned either to eat bread. She kept on asking that Elisha should turn to eat bread. And she said unto her husband, Behold now, I perceive this is an holy man of God, which passes by us continually. And let's go forward. Let us make a little chamber. I pray thee on the wall. And let us set for him there a bed and a table and a stool and a candlestick. And it shall be when he cometh to us that he shall turn it thither. And it fell on a day that he came, he turned into the chamber and laid there and see what happened. And he said to Gehazi, he said, call the woman and she stood before him. Now let's go to the next verse. And he said unto him, say now unto her, behold, thou hast been too careful for us with all this care. What is to be done for you? After this giving, after this treatment, what do you want us to do for you? <laughs> and here what that woman said, said I'm fulfilled in all things. There's nothing you can do for me. And she answered, I dwell in the midst of my own people. I'm an authority. There is nothing you are going to do for me. I'm wealthy, I'm rich, but there's something that only God can do that the woman did not have. And hear what he said. And he said, what then is to be done for her? And Gazi answered, verily she had no child, and her husband is old. That was hopeless case. And that was what she would not be able to give to herself. And he said, call her. And when he had called her, she stood in the door. And look at that one. And he said, about this season, according to the time of life, thou shalt embrace a son. And she said, nay, my lord, thou man of God, do not lie unto thy handmaid to see the crisis, to see how helpless and hopeless the case was. But according to that word, she gave birth. Time will not permit me to talk about that of Elijah who delivered the widow of Zarephath. Time will not permit me to talk about even David, about this mighty man that they gave to God. Time will not permit me to talk about Manuel. That while they were preparing food for the angel, he rode on the sacrifice fire and he went off. There is power in giving and God is so good. He say a cup of cold water, affordable, cheap and not too expensive. No matter your level, God has given you a seed to connect to this prophet's life and there are benefits that will attend to it. Not all cases at times answer to prayer but all cases answers to giving. I pray that the Lord will open your heart. The Lord will open your understanding. I know, I know our prophet will not say this and he did not ask me. He did not ask me. If I told him that I would be ministering along this direction, he would take the microphone from me. <laughs> but there is also a dimension of Yano that if we keep quiet about it, most people will not experience the best that God wants them to be. If you place value on where there is virtue, then virtue will flow. But if you do not place value on the gift that the Lord has given unto us, you will not be able to maximize the benefits. Whatever you have, please, I want you to open up your heart. I want you to have a desire. I want you to have an expression. Barrenness, you go as I sow this seed. Poverty, you go as I sow this seed. Sickness, you go as I sow this seed. Abraham did it. Abraham was blessed. Sarah did it. Sarah was blessed. The Shunammite woman did it and she was blessed. The Samaritan did it, she was blessed. The widow of Zarephath did it, she was blessed. If you do it, I'm, I bet to say this, you will surely be blessed. May the Lord be with you. May the Lord breathe upon this world. May this world create many. I'm saying that the power to do, the grace to do, will rest upon you all over the world in the mighty name of Jesus. Let that amen be a bit bigger. Thank you. Hallelujah. If you are clapping, why don't you make it louder? Give God a shout of praise. I want us to rise to our feet and sing a happy birthday song to God's servant. Today is his day. Amen. One to go. Two. Happy. 
to you. Happy birthday. Prosperity, fresh oil in Jesus' name. Please, may be seated. God bless you. As you celebrate God's servant today, men too will celebrate you. In the name of Jesus. Mark chapter 12, verse 41 to 43. That was powerful from the lips of uh, one of the greatest teachers I've ever met in my life. Dr. Usholali, I used to enjoy listening to him and just sitting down. Under his teaching, so anointed. Praise God. Mark chapter 12, verse 41 to 43. Hallelujah. And Jesus sat over against the treasury and beheld how people cast money into the treasury. And many that were rich cast in much. So Jesus showed that God is interested in the treasury. And there came a certain poor widow. And she threw in two mites, which made a fatten. And he called unto him his disciples and said unto them, Verily I say unto you that this poor widow has cast more in than all they which have cast into the treasure. Proverbs eleven twenty four to 25. Proverbs eleven twenty four and 25. Proverbs 11. There is... That scatter it and yet increase it. And there is that we told it more than is meet, for it tended to poverty. Verse 25. The Libra soul shall be made fat, and he that water it shall be watered also himself. Acts 20 35. Finally, Acts 20 35. Acts 20 35. Acts 20, 35. I have showed you all things. How that so laboring you ought to support the weak. And to remember the words of our Lord Jesus. How he said, let's read it loud. It is more blessed to give. So Jesus too preached about giving. It is, Jesus told them, told the disciples, it is more blessed to give than to receive. You see, giving is the proof of love. Giving is the proof of an encounter with God. Giving is the proof of your trust in God. Giving is the proof that a man has overcome greed. Giving is the proof of your faith in the power of God. Every giving never leaves a man the same. The more you give, the more you grow in your commitment and your relationship with God. You are either a giver or a hoarder. You see, your giving shows your heart. Your giving shows God's position in your life. Your giving shows all that Jesus and his gospel meant to you. Your giving shows the importance of kingdom assignment to you. Your giving shows your readiness to receive and do the word of God. No giving leaves you the same. In the kingdom of God, we have givers and hoarders. And let me tell you something about givers. Givers are a blessing. Number two, givers are God's channel of blessing to humanity. Number three, givers are divine messengers among men. Givers are angels among men. Givers are solution providers and their answers to prayers. 
When a man is praying to God, God looks for givers who will answer their prayers. When a church is praying to God, God looks for givers who answer their prayers. Because givers answer prayers. When a giver enters a church, he is always an answer to prayer. Givers are kingdom promoters. When you become a giver, you join a glorious army, expanding and establishing the kingdom of God on earth. Why do we give? You see, because today we are talking about giving. Why do we give? Because our Dr. Shawala has told us the benefit of giving. Why do we give? We give, please listen to me and please write it down. We give, why? Because number one, it is commanded. It is commanded. We don't give because the church is in need. We don't give because the pastor is in need. No, we give because it is commanded. Give and it shall be given unto you. Number two, we give because we love God. And our giving shows our love for God. Our giving shows our love for God. So we can't love God without giving him. For God so loved the world that he gave. So the way we show love is when we give. Number three. We give to show our interest in kingdom expansion. It is givers that brought this camp here. Is givers. The reason why we are in this studio is givers. It's givers that made this studio possible. That's why God will keep blessing givers. Number four reason why we give is to show that we recognize the work of God and we appreciate God's work on the earth. To show that we recognize the work of God and that we appreciate God's work on the earth. The way a sinner will be blessed or we get money, let me use money, and go and build a bar and go and build a home for prostitutes and go and build a, 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 a drinking joint and a joint for Indian hemp smokers and you know, drug addicts is the way a believer will get the blessing and put it in crusades. Why do we give? Giving shows our faith in God and in his word. God's word say give. So we give. Because we believe in God's word that says we should give. Finally, why do we give? It shows our readiness to receive the promised blessing of giving. Every giving has a promised blessing. So when we don't give, it means we don't believe in the promised blessing. So, but when we give, it means we believe in that promise and we are activating it. I went to a church to preach. As, a, you see, as an evangelist, I was preaching. I went to a church to preach. And when I go to a church on Sunday morning before I preach, the pastor came to the altar and uh, he said something. He said, he said, church, last week, Tuesday, the landlady, it's a warehouse, there is a warehouse. The landlady of this place came and, uh, you know, it was not funny. He tore my clothes. He showed the church his shirt because the church was owing rent. He tore my clothes and uh, he said he's coming back. <laughs> so please help me. Let's pay this rent. And there, I think that there, the rent was 60000 So where I sat, I was flicking through my, my notes when I heard God's voice. Pay it. I said, Lord, I don't have it. He said, you have it. I said, okay, show me. I said, if you sell all the electronics in your house, it will pay. It will pay it. I said, you mean? He said, yes. Pay it. Carry those electronics. Go and sell them. Give it so that the landlady will not, uh, will not come back. Now, he has members in the church. I hear what I'm saying. So, I, after service, I preach. After service, I just spoke to him. He was shocked. I told my wife, and uh, we gathered all the electronics, everything in the house. 
my daughter who is now in the university looked at the mother because I was not at home. The TV, you know, the special one sent from Germany, they used to sit in front of it. She said to my wife, she said, where is our television going? My wife said to her, Jesus need it. It's okay, tell Jesus to return the TV after you see it. <laughs> you see, they sold it and uh, you know, they paid it. and God said to me, he said, from today, you will not lag. That was when I started driving cars. Now, you see, when you give, it doesn't leave you the same. And I noticed that every time you give, you, you shift. You shift. You see, even in your mind, there's a shift. If you have never given 10,000 in your life, as soon as you give it, you shift. You are no more afraid of that level. If you have never given a hundred thousand in your life, as soon as you give it, you shift. You see, you are the reason why you are afraid of that number is because you have never given it. You give it and see whether you will not shift. What do you give? I want to quickly show you what to give. You see, because talk about giving, what do you give? Number one is the tithe. Malachi 310. Malachi 310. The tithe. God said, bring ye all the tithe to the storehouse. I think all of us knows that. Please listen to me. Blessed are the titans, for they shall enjoy open heaven. Blessed are the titans, for the devourer shall be far from them. Blessed are titans, for they shall keep enjoying overflowing blessings. Number two thing that I want to give is fellowship offering. As we come together for fellowship, 1 Corinthians chapter 16 verse 2. Please very quickly, because of time, because we'll 1 Corinthians 16 verse 2. You see, upon the first day of the week, let every one of you lay by him in store as God has prospered him that there be no guarding when I come. So, so the one we give every service on Sundays is commanded. That's, the, that's our fellowship offering. And we give it as gratitude to God. Number three, thing that will give is project offerings for kingdom expansion. For kingdom expansion. Now, this one shows your love for the work of God. Number four. Is it number four? Giving to the poor. Proverbs 19.17. Giving to the poor. Proverbs 19.17. Or anyone that you are better than. He that pity the poor. Lend debt unto the Lord. And that which he had given. Will he pay him again? He said God will pay him again. Praise God. God will pay him again. Number number what? Number five is the first fruit. Is the first fruit. Proverbs 3, verse 9. The first fruit shows your dependency on God. The Lord, I depend on you. I depend on you. Praise God. Number, number six is sacrifice. Sacrifice. Psalm 126, verse 5 and 6. Psalm 26, verse 5, verse 5 and 6. He said, They that, and he, he that goeth for, verse 5 and 6. Verse 5, not verse 1. He that goeth, they that sow in tears shall reap in joy. Verse 6. Verse 6. He that goeth forth and weepeth, bearing precious seed, shall doubtless come again with rejoicing, bringing his sheaves with him. This is describing sacrifice. Then number seven is seed sowing. Zechariah chapter 8 verse 12. Seed sowing. Zechariah chapter 8 verse 12. I like this Zechariah 8 12. Seed sowing. That's how we take seeds. That's how we say, you know, take seeds. Zechariah 8 12. He said, the very, the very first Sentence say, and the seed shall be prosperous. So we command prosperity over our finances when we sow seeds. Then number number seven is it number seven or number eight? Is honoring your man of God. That is the one that Doctor was just emphasizing. Honoring your pastor, honoring your prophet, honoring your man of God. 
Matthew chapter 10, verse 41 to 42. Matthew 10, who is, who is on the console? Matthew chapter 10, 41 to 42. Jesus said, he that receive a prophet in the name of a prophet shall receive a prophet's reward. He that receive a righteous man in the name of a righteous man shall receive a righteous man's reward. Verse 42. I like, this is powerful. Please read it if, if, if you can see. Read it. And whosoever shall give to drink unto one of these little ones a cup of cold water only in the name of a disciple. Verily I say to you, he shall in no wise. Jesus said, I send my disciples out. Anyone that put anything in their hand because they are my disciples, because they are my servants, because he's a man of God, he said he will not lose his reward. That is a vow. That is a solemn vow from Jesus. That you do it, you don't lose your reward. I've heard prophet give several testimony. Somebody put a million in his hand, you know, in the beginning of the year, and he came to say that you know, he, he, he saw what he has not seen in a whole year. The, that is the word that is coming to pass in his life. Honoring your, your pastor, honoring your prophet, what it shows is that you recognize the gift of God around you. That Father, thank you for this gift you have given unto me. How do you give? How do you give? Finally, give honorably. Because your God is not hungry. God, is, is, God does not need what we give. He gave it to us in the first place. So don't bring it with arrogance. Don't bring it you know, with an air of, you know, without me. He has done many things without you. Give honorably. Number two, give consistently. Give consistently. Number three, give continually. Give continually. Number four, give tirelessly. Huh? That is how we got here. I'm sure you know that, you know, the first meeting that we came to hold here, we did it on that canopy. How many of you were there at that time? Eh? That one, one, we can't call it a satanic habit. It came with, uh, with, a, with almost freezing temperature. And it knocked down the canopy. And we were praying under the rain and under the cold. And we were there. And we were here for almost, for a bit like, you know, it was always for either 14 days or so. And we're all here. And uh, we were all on the on muddy ground. But see where it is now. It is tireless giving that got it to where it is. And it is tireless giving that will take it to a, a higher level. You see, tireless giving, we, we command tireless blessing from heaven. Because we keep giving it. Look, God is not wicked though. God is not wicked. As you are doing it, he is opening unto you the windows of heaven. And he's blessing you. Please don't put anything in the hand of God's servant as a beggar. He's not a beggar. You see, and what you are giving him, you are not blessing him. He is the one blessing you. You can't bless him. He is the one that can bless you. So when you are putting it in his hand, you are, he's, he's a channel of blessing. Because it was not Abraham that blessed uh, Melchizedek. It was Melchizedek that blessed Abraham. Abraham put in his hand, the man said, blessed be Abraham. So that is what you need to hear. That blessing that God bless you and your heaven will be open. Somebody is here today, your heaven will be open. Give without murmuring. Give without grumbling or complaining. Because God is not hungry. He said, if I were hungry, I won't tell you. So don't murmur, don't come with murmuring. How do you give again? Give with joy. Give with joy. Give with gratitude. Give with gratitude. 
Finally, when do you give? When do you give? You give when necessity becomes. When you see an opportunity, you give. You jump into the, into the healing waters when the angel has just stirred the water. So when, once you see necessity, please jump in. This is a time, you see, the birthday season is a necessity time. To show that God's servant, you are a blessing to us. You are a blessing to humanity. I do this. I do this one. I do this one. I do this one for you. Number two, you give when you are shown God's word about giving. As soon as you are shown God's word, the anointing is there. Jump in that time, it will happen. Jump in that time, the, the, the heaven will be open. Over your head. My wife, somebody was owing my wife once. No, of, of course, she's my wife. Now, somebody was owing her. It was big money. And the person told her she did the business. The person said she would not pay. That anything she can do, she should go and do. So we, we, we finished a service on Sunday. And my wife came and kneeled down. I said, what is it? She said that uh, I, want to, I want to challenge God. I said, how do you want to do it? He said, somebody is owing me and refused to pay. I said, so what do you want to do? She said she has gone to close her account. And how much was it? She said, this is it. That she won't go to fight for her. She kneeled down. I said, okay. In the name of Jesus, go fight for this, this precious daughter of God. I said, drop it in the offering box. She dropped the money in the offering box the following week. This woman started calling her. This woman, come and collect your money. Or come and collect your money. Now, please listen. Now, this woman gave her three checks. Now, all the three checks were banks domiciled in Nonicha. Now, all the banks were in Nonicha. So, we in show she didn't want to pay. Now, my wife went to a bank. Her bank said, we will collect the money. So, as, the, as soon as the last check cleared, the woman said, Mrs. Otaro is a witch. He said, how did, how did I pay? He said, you don't know the God I serve. Now, she came to the altar. She said, God, you see, the reason why God don't fight is because you don't make him to fight. It's not only prayer that make him to fight. You see, push men to him and say, God, fight my battle for me. I do this one for God. And see if your heaven will not be open. There are 1,000 people online that their heaven will be open right now. In the name of Jesus. A man came to church, came to me and he said, so you know, he said, he said, he said, something told me to give you this money. I said, how much was it? He said, the money was 8,000. And he said, before I give you, let me tell you the story behind this money. I said, okay, tell me. He said, if I give you this money now, I will be hungry throughout this weekend. I said, okay. I said, don't. I said, okay, me, I don't need it. I said, okay, if you bring 2,000, take 6,000. She said, no. I said, okay, let's share. He said, no. He said, the thing says to give it all to you. I said, okay. Okay, bring it. He said, but if I give you this money, I don't know how I will survive this weekend. Because this is all I have. It was a Friday service. I said, okay, now, nah, okay, okay, bring it. Honestly, I knew he was, he was sincere. I saw tears in his eyes. Because he lives alone, and that was all he had. So I prayed for him. I prayed, prayed, prayed. As soon as I, pray, I collected the money, I pushed him out. Before he would wait and start crying on my neck. So he left. I didn't see him for two weeks. Now, now, suddenly, did I heard, you know, I heard a vehicle. I heard beam, 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 beam. Downstairs beside my office. So I said, who is that? I saw somebody came out of a car. He was shouting. He was a man of God. Ha, he go to put money for your hand. I said, come and give me the testimony. He said he was hungry that weekend. Though. He said he fasted from that Friday to, to Monday. Because I didn't see him in church on Sunday. He said he got to his office on Monday. An NNPC job that they told him he needed to know the minister who will need to come to and meet the, the, the director. Who will need all these things? God, God just bypass everybody. They sent a letter to him. Now, you know, the surprising thing was that the letter was signed on that day, that time that he gave that. 
that on that Friday. Now, he, 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 they go to his office. He go to an NPC. Now, the contract was signed and he was mobilized. He was paid 70%. He came, he lied and said, this God. Look, I said, is, there is a way God fought for you. It's because you obeyed him. Once you hear him, do it. I pray for you today. Hear this. There is a blessing in this service. There is a blessing in this meeting today. In the name of it that died and rose again, you will not lose your blessing. You will not lose your blessing. You will not lose your blessing. In the name of Jesus. You are commanded to give not because the church is in need. You are commanded because you are the one that is in need. You need it. Maybe your own is turn around. Maybe your own is breakthrough. Maybe your own is open heaven. Maybe it's even a job. Maybe it's even sickness. Tonight, jump in this water. Jump in the See what will happen. God is set to turn your life around. Somebody is watching online. God wants to use this bad day to give a testimony. And I pray for you today. In the name of it that died and rose again. God will use this bad day to turn somebody's life around. Millions are coming to your hands. Your heaven will be open. Shall I receive it? Glory be to God. Let's celebrate God in the life of our Papa that is celebrating his birthday today. Yes, let's appreciate God. Let's appreciate God for his life, for the energy, for the anointing, for the glory, for the grace. Let's appreciate God. Let's appreciate God. Amen. So we thank God for the life of our Papa and the life of uh, our mommy in the Lord, grace of this dispensation. Yeah, we thank God. Uh, I want to use this opportunity to pray, to use Baba as a point of contact for those of you that are here today, that whatever might be your heart desire, because you are hearing uh, what we are doing right now, and because you are here in the studio, I declare and decree that you are the next testifier. Whether you like it or not, God will fight your battle. You will move to your next level. As we are celebrating Papa today, you too will be celebrated. Your heaven of mercy has been opened. Heaven will declare your glory. It shall be well with you. No weapon of action against you shall prosper. All your spiritual enemies shall be scattered. By this time of next year, you will come with your husband. By this time of next year, you will come with your baby. By this time of next year, you'll be hearing up from Canada. I declare that that your visa will be given to you. They will not deny you. In the name of Jesus, my God will embarrass you financially. He will boost your financial status. With that contract you are running after, God will grant it unto you. God will approve it and give it to you. In the name of Jesus. Mugba, dura nibitoti ye yere, olono aso ye yere da ye ye. A grand you go. No, look at Jesu on any testimony. Go by and time would do love for Corrie or Yagba or Corre. You were told, Wow, only I could son in Nore. Go boy, eat your walk or one lorry or around could suck power. Mugba, drag, look over by my tear, Mimima, book when it don't look over by Lavo Torire, and it don't look quite down she. Mugba, drag, ruin back, will have wasted life for one. But go roadblock, all the roadblock man tell before you that they have not allowed you to cross into your glory. Mosoro, that alone, every Pudosa, we are called Pudosi, Loru Kobaba Matia, Mimima, Loru called Jesu, one of the ladies I got alone. Mugbadra, the officer, you get your promotion. They will not sack you. You will not be devoted in the name of Jesus. Ah, Mugbadra, Loru called Jesu, but I get on board, why do they act or lower? As we are crossing to the month of April, you will receive that glory. In the name of Jesus. Between now and Sunday, I declare that that angel will visit you. 
the goodness that has been given to him there, he will deliver it to you. In the name of Jesus. That is just what I can say. Because we started from nothing. And I mean nothing. So for where we are now, we can't explain. I remember there was a time we were talking. I was like, you know, I said, ah, maybe when he gets to heaven, he's going to ask Baba God how he did it for him. So he cannot explain. And none of us can explain. So God has been there. Arasan, atagun fe, ijicha, kudegewa lo. There have been many challenges. 
So if I we, I'm here and I'm telling you that everything has been sweet, 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 and I lie. There have been challenges. There has been a lot of troubles. But the Lord has been there. And if we don't open our mouth to tell you, we will never see it written on our face. So as you are looking at us, we think all is fine. But by his grace, all is fine. So our God has been so good. And just one thing I want to say here tonight is that this man of God loves God. He loves God. Even when he's strong, once there's a call for the things of the kingdom, you will, not, you will never see him staying back. He will go. He can come back. Hmm. And be looking at somebody that will not stand up the second day. But before the day break, you know, Jimmy, Jimmy, the man the five o'clock. Jimmy. By the time I wake him up, at five months, you see him. So tired, but yet, the kingdom work must be done. And also, he loves men, even regardless of their faults. Even regardless of their faults. He loves, he's just, he just loves people. Even though when he sees that they are not doing it rightly, he loves them. A lot of time, people will be saying this, if I be telling him this, it's like, he loves, the way he loves God, he also loves me. I'm not here to catch you. And most of the time, we fight. A lot concerns some issues, but I, I've seen it. Some of the time, I will just keep quiet. That's the extent to which he loves God. And loves me. Many a times people will say, I'm going to go to the house. 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 So that is just it. Man of God, I celebrate you. I celebrate you. I celebrate you. Actually, I will not fail to say this singular thing whenever I am given opportunity to speak. And this is one thing. You sisters, when you are praying for husband, Emma Ladada, you pray and pray and tell God what you really want. I will not forget. When we were in school then, all what we as you knows how to pray about. God, give me Jim, Jim, brothers. But the Jim, Jim, God now gave me, past my power. <laughs> Amen. You know, all of you will see it now. Most of the time you are here. Me, I can't cope. So, but I will be somewhere knocking my head too. So, the Jim, Jim, God gave me, actually, is not really what I expected. Actually, one thing was that I didn't really want to marry him. I didn't want to marry a man of God at all. I was running from a man of God and I, I now fell to his hand again. So, but, um, all along, this God has been faithful. He gives strength to who that has no strength. So he has been faithful. Again, man of God, I celebrate you. You are indeed a man of God. Praise ye the Lord. I can face tomorrow. I don't know tomorrow, but tomorrow is in God's hands. Because of leaves. Come on, everybody. All fear is gone. <laughs> because I know. Because I know.
I'll just say because uh, we'll be rounding up in the next uh, five minutes. Because uh, program commenced this morning again. The time chapter 32, verse 9, verse 10, verse 11, 12 and 13. For the Lord's portion is his people. For the Lord's portion is his people. Jacob is the Lord of his inheritance. He found him in the desert land. And in the waste howling wilderness. And he led him about. Number two, he instructed him. Number three, he kept him. As he happened. Of his ass. Look at that three thing. He led him. He instructed him. He kept him. Don't forget that three thing. Once he found you, he has responsibility to you to lead you. Number two, to instruct you. And number three, to be kept by him. You understand? Now, if he finds you, if you are his portion. To bat you rear. That is why fear I see to my rear. Position yourself where I will find you. Hello means you be told how she could share. He found him. Somebody shall he found me. The last portion is his people. Jacob is the lot of his sentence. He found him. In the desert land, in the like in the desert land, in the west howling wilderness, and he led him about, he instructed him, he kept him as the apple of his eyes. And number eleven, the Bible says, as an eagle star of an ass, fluttered over a young, spread it abroad, abroad and wings, taken them, buried them in her wings. And verse twelve. So the Lord alone, underline that in your scripture, the Lord alone led him, and there was no string God with him. Alone, alone, Daria could see a deity of Shani Harare. And he led alone by God, no string God. Ben, Boba Chule, Toba Kumbita, why she was done. If you fall down here and you die, I'm getting my wife going to be. Or to be in the jail, so you get better, but you get no war and move here, me, me, me. They were later on when to be for me. If you do it, to bad deal or joy, bend it, or just to be in like here, so they so cool, you are long way and move for me, me, me. Say go social mean like bear. Say what's all long at tea. The problem of our generation is that we divide God's attention. I follow the percentage. I don't find where I mean the percentage. So I want to make you know Ben. There is no other string God's. That is why we are of it. Bishop at the same time, 42 years ago. We are all the And we give our lives. He had the light. Our Father and the Lord. Reverend Paul Adibayo is the one I invited to do the journey for me when I was doing my wedding in 1996, 28 years ago. Everybody, because you shall come to me, drop and alone, stay with him. It's enough for you. Sharing your love with him is just wasting your future. By here, to go sing, come here. Do you know, Tito? Tito, but he don't quite double. The one that is coming is coming. 
If he has not come now, he's still coming. But if you come to your time, it won't come at your time. 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 In John chapter 11, he said, hey, Jesus, hey, Lazarus, the one you love, he's sick. Only motivo, also not so juicy. For another three days. Oh, Jacoku. And he died for four days. Oh, John Mary Lofiku. So, don't you pay? Lazarus did that. You pay King Jesus who come out with son, nice son, love. Jesus, Veki, Ogwaye, Kodi, CNN, publicity. People buy your mark, bro. To ba kan je nu esan la san lati wo lasaru ko se to ma gbo story e a wa gan ni fi soro ijo wo lo wa su lori eh iya yawo peteru ti o ni asan ba ti jesus fa lowo so ke ijo wo ni e di topic lori asamon ti ni e ojo le fi wa su mi ori pastor to gbe eh je ka wa su loni eh jesus si wo iya yawo eh eh peteru to sai san ba but emo yo jo ti gbogbo ayi ti fun gba su lori lasaru tori pe won ni eni ti wo feran the one he, that you love e feran ti e ti ku oni pe o lo feran jesus jesus wa feran pe ayan se n da to bayi ba so some of this was so good so o wa olohun jesus fun re lo wa feran lasaru bayi won wa ni eni ti wo feran saison ah o ni e fi le Mama, I just be a good boy. She look good today, no. I just go cool. Jesus, you are in law. I just met that soon. She saw Jesus. So video, I just can't do the cool thing, no. Jesus has a family. I'm in Lazarus. I'm in Wasu. I'm in Jaloji. Ah, I will have brought Jesus into Wasu. Eh, go to fun. Eh, oh, let go there. Tim on so. I love the cool. Ah, I can't do one. I just love cool. Pay well, Jody. Talk me about cool. Come for me. I want cool. No, Lazarus, cool. Eh. But we are not cooked well. Amen. Yes, we need our family to learn cook well. We are very lucky. I want to go and raise him, not to go and die with him. But he does not want to die. But let us go and die with him. No, this was God there. Only so you know your brother will rise again. I only on the resurrection money. Say now, roll away the stone now. Olo ti run wa to e mo be mi gan mo mo je ko duro to fi ma run ni Olorun mo mo duro fun kesi e ko ma run ni Tori o fe fi ajulo nla kan lori oro yen eri ti gbogbo aye ma ma gbo ti won ni le so tan ti awon awon be so nbi won be so nbi won be so nbi aduro lori o ti to The person you love Sir, she won't let you want to love well, it debut with you alone. Fernand, Coco, and the pay were fair not long. Who had the pay alone to have fair not work for it? Ah, your man let them in luck on me. Level luck on me. If but he can't be, but go come with them when he's a good thing for the meta tackle. I come with Anna Zuloki, forty months. We will go to Masukuma. Our mommy has a key. Why we are to move? I want to buy me our mom will leave. We are about almost five hundred. No space to sleep again. One of my daughter came from Chevron. Was a party Friday, Lumbo. Go back to Korai, and she started to go back to my own complain. Baba, eh, because if that verse, what did I want money? You want to know the lyrics? Because it's so okay. Why can't you do something? Kilo Lise to support the work. Lori, okay, eh. Olo na le kodo support the dormitory on mad only give us six million. Me o borrow o be yari. Olo only give us six million. Can't pull why could this young come back? Boys they saw six million. You buy more gun for low one. You yarado baba salao. Baba, oh mommy, if I if I want to drop us six million for you, can we call dormitory so that Katule marry the sosi? One of my son to buy his kid now. I want him one. One day I'm going to see baba why is that? Can't put ye. Come on, she ain't gonna come back. It be our mother can't know our mother don't tell it. You know I have six million. Let who don't know I have six million. Money. It's all city. I don't know if I have six. They okay. Be like a lot. Hey, oh, jale only put ye. Money. I go do a mock one. Oh, Tony, be truthful, be righteous, do it plainly. 
Iwa ke to nwa sodo eyan ko ni oje odide e to lo nba ti si o ni oje odide eh those are the problem that we have and when you tell that the garden kan sodo ara won olorun ni yen o ni ju o iyan o fe bi po ni e te nba ti si o ni oju o eh e ti ma ti si o ni no ti to kan ni no to mu mo je mo do baba sala tu ah baba yan wo mi pe ah iru eyan wo lokun ni lo ba be si gbadura omo yen bo se n gbadura mu mo pa adura yen ti wo ni re be lo olorun so fun mi o ni nes ori oke ori o camp yin le ti ma se e ni lo kaaki mo ni bi ti o si any building how it will happen nobody know e wo olorun eh je n gbadura fun o mo n gbagbe o Kosio shaka kala dole. No other gods. God alone. And don't pull alone anu ni kanyo. No other gods. Sikbe eja wole taba wole a montasi. Nda bale se ntambe ngu si nte. Alone ni kanyo. On wa alone mi ma wo. Don't seek for any other god. And do it with all righteousness. He know how to raise you. He know how to lift you. Only your Tony is my to serve you. Oma Dideo. Oma Dideo. Oma Dideo. Ben, when I was buying churches all around Lagos, I made a few hundred million. I rented a new. We rented the house. Long money. Ben, now last year we rented house. Aso ngba ta do Jose and Dr. Fred awon diaspora eh a prophet eh won rent le mo ki lo se baba eh ja fi mi le je ki ma je de mi je polo o wo me je se ben but by the grace of god awon diaspora yen awon owo ti won be si da ngba yen gbogbo won ta won to wa Jerusalem yen ni o no be si da owo won si akanti o do Dr. Fred ni won da wo ni won da wo ni won da wo ni won lo wo nwo bi 45 million ori ta gbo wo kan kan ta si an kan ben but to me nga baba ah eh aduro wo iwa o wo en da kini kan atira leyin e mo tun lo si ayobo ni mo lo ra building kan be fun jesu 60 million leyin e mo lo so gbo mo chola lo ra 55 million am 60 million ben eh so gbo gbo e ti won le yen asan ni o se le ijobo orun why don't you seek after him o se je ko lon gbe olorun lo ma gbe on to nwa fun o e ma ko nkan ti se ti e olorun si nbe o so please that's why o mo fe so lori mi kan o fe o je you see be ise yen bi eni pe iwo lo ni pe wa ti jesu pe ti o ba subu aye esubu when they put you in the department do it as unto the lord that if he fall if that department for you have you are you are wasted ko gbe ka won ba se won aye eni won ko so le lori ni so aye mi ni for that's your life but to ba tin di gbe eh ah eh you are on your own. You are your own. You are your own. You mo be yin sa gbogbo eyin ti en gbo mi ni agbaye eyin partner wa atun fe sese mi bayi atun fe bere clinic ta fe se lolofe fun gbogbo community makogi magboro ami eh eh abule oba ni bi kabesi a fe bere clinic ami mo agba wo san fe ma fun won logo doctor ma wa nbe nurse ma wa nbe awon to ba ni lowo san wa ma wa ben so gbogbo yen tin lo labele bayi 
to ba ba fe se a pe yin ke wa si eh to igi se eh ben to dori pe ah ti oro pe eh awon to ba ni lowo san wa 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 si be oga se bi oluwa ti fe ko se o ibu kun a de wa sodo e o ma wa nkan mo ya o ma wa nkan mo ya o to ba ku be se mefa pere ni ile to ko wa gbe oja de nbe ta wa sin o si ma wa nkan mo ya o eternity ni ko ma wo won gbodo so pe won ka ruko olorun won roruko e nbe eternity is the place yo. let it be your focus i want to make it at the end of my journey with jesus that should be your focus and when that become your focus every other thing will work for you Shall we rise up? Let me pray with you. Olorun anu. Gbogbo eni to sha ni agbaye ni oni aro on the 29. Bi e ti sha mi. Egba! Olorun anu ko yo si. Eyan mo woli ninu ile e mo sha mi bi bi ariya o di ase loni ma je mu. En don pe Olorun anu ko yo si. The God of mercy will appear to you. Amen. We appear in your house. Amen. We appear on your children. Amen. In your business. Amen. And there one your hospital. Those who are in hospital, hear the voice of God. God of mercy will appear to you. Hey, Adiba Satani Kabasita. Arubala Satani Abakasita. Baba Mio. Neojo. But the Pharaoh in Genesis 40, O Meji lo shele, O lo beori kan soke, O se beori kan. Two things, On the day of bed in Genesis 40, One head was lifted, Another head was cut off. E mi nan do la ti shi O Meji, O ri e ni to kan la ti be soke. If you are the next for your head to be lifted, as you shout amen like thunder, your head is lifted. Amen. Nabi kurum bushi atana kasiria. Alonu anu baba ame. Ori talo kan la ti besoke. Ori talo kan la ti besoke. Bi ami ababori oyaka gbi ori resoke. Ori omo talo kan la ti besoke. Hey, only Ola ka gbe ori oko re soke. Ta le ni tu ya ka be ori re ki ini ajo le san fun o. The one that must go down for your life to go up. The one that must disappear for you to appear. The one that God must deal, deal with for you to have favor and mercy. And in that on them wa ye re. And you are lying there with your bad one here. Oh, my shammy. Oh, yeah, come call a John. Oh, yeah, come call a John. You want to look back, but answer one, one, some, you know, look alone. Money come call a John. Ah, a de caprata sahiata. All around, no babami. But go on in a. Don't feel cucumbalo. Don't you go buy share, Lu? Don't you go buy one more, Lu? You watch me, I cannot buy one. My jam one, oh, more bell or your robber, I will walk with boy. That's okay. In Baba, but there was studio, and you can't be a Sibobo. In Baba, that America, and ye, Tia and Baba was okay. And your mom will leave, Bobo. Ain't my mambo boy. A 
Ebon Olua lenu mi. Eyin ko Olorun. O di ase Olorun o. Iran lo wa alai le ni. Agba alai le ni kan. Mo be o. Ki o ba nfun eni ni ba pade kan. O ya gba i ba pade na. Shami bi omo woli gba i ba pade na. Gba i ba pade na. Iwa lo ni gba i ba pade. Oku e kan gba i ba pade. Eni ba ta ko lato ni yo subo ni wa ju. Mercy will rest you. Amen. Mercy will lift you. Amen. Mercy will open the door. Amen. Whatever is. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Say, I do you let say so. Lies, see. Oh, be here to your long visit, Bermy. Or talk about the fair and the buburu. Are you a no, the buburu? Ben. Mo be on long o, o be on your door wa eh ni shifre o. Ah, I want man le o ni shile ya o. Your children will not go into wrong homes. O go any ti on swe kuni abeg be ya wo. Ti oba shami anu jude ajosi o. On ton don la mo nou le on ran yon yon. Amen. Mo le man yon ju. Amen. Shebe fun wa. Amen. O shami shebe fun wa. Amen. O luwa ati wani ik pele to kamba yi. Mo be o lan run. Le ni to tun de yi. O ya ki wana a wano e. Amen. Lodun an lo zopin kwe plen ti de. Mo anan si fan wen yon. Elo min yin mo kwe plen ni kwa plen ni. I want to hear the cup of that joy. Don't talk about plenty, plenty, row. I want to talk about what you know. I just want plenty now. One go key. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lord God, Jesus, plenty of today. Oh yeah, one way. I'm a country come go me new. Oju one way. Bang, one way. I done it. Gula, don't be any way. Jura, you lose on the mukolo. Iro ya yo to gbari o ya lo gba iro ya Bo gbo en te je bukun fun wa ni ba de leyi bo gbo n te se ati n te fe se e gbo won oluwa Olorun fi gbe yi soke Orun oni ti mo yin o Gbo en partner wa ti en ran ise ilowo lona kan ati omiran gbogbo eh 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 Oh, ba mo yeta san lo yi redi lo su. O ki so ro 10 million. Eh, budget wa lo su ki so ro ro ba 25 million. To bo do jade ni check. Eh. Se yen wa tax lo bank. Tax ya wo. Tax gbe ga le nikan lori ta tin ke tin da kan le. Ti orun si si lojo ju mo e duro ti o olohun anu ni won pe o mo ba aye ra soro won to ni ra fun oju laye bo tin sami orun o yanju e so pe olohun anu yanju e won ri ariwo pa olohun anu yanju e won to le fun mi ju laye won to le fun mi ju laye Somebody shall God of mercy set to it now the most difficult thing in my life in the life of my children in my business in my ministry in my career God of mercy set to it Oni se wa papo mo ojo ti Jesu lo si kafari Eyin eyan sami loruko Jesu Makibara ase ni to lo kafari to teje sile o ya ko yo si won Amen I sara re ko para Amen won ni won mu enikan lada 
Jesus. There is a healing coming to somebody. Amen. Somebody, oh, Shami, I said, I'm not para. Amen. And me, no lay, we are going to Amen. You are living for God. Amen. You are rising. Amen. You are sharing your testimony. Amen. I cover you with the blood of Jesus. Lord Jesus. Victory for you. Amen. Victory for your family. Amen. Victory for your destiny. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Victory for Nigeria. Amen. The nation you are worshiping for, victory for you. Amen. Here. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you, Lord. We honor you forever. Hallelujah. In the name of the Father. Amen. Son and the Holy Ghost. Amen. Hallelujah and Latia Okerio. to cut the cake. J E S U S. Jesus. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy Please wait for your takeaway. We want to appreciate all our partners both here in Nigeria and uh, oversee our sponsor who made it to happen today. Uh, it was a surprise to our papa. He does not know that this thing is going to come to pass. Our sponsor, the Lord will surprise you in Jesus' name. Uh, the ceremony to continue this morning. within our space. Can we celebrate God in the life of our Father and the Lord one more time? Praise God. Hallelujah. I want to thank God in the life of our Father and the Lord and all the anointed ministers of God that the Lord has used to bless us tonight and every music minister that have ministered to our spirit, we ask that God will increase your grace in the name of Jesus. Amen. To all the sons and daughters of the prophet, always available in the studio, to our beautiful choir, to our technical crew, the sound and the media team, we ask that God will increase your grace in the name of Jesus. Amen. If today's your first time on YouTube, please do well to subscribe so that you can get notified ASAP whenever we are live on this channel. I beg you, by the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ. So we come your way again later today for another time in his presence and also later tonight, 12 a.m. Nigerian time. But before then, your testimony and mine shall be evident in the name of Jesus. Amen. I remain Adekola Olamile Kwandeleke. If only call Samus Lake on the Lord bless you. <laughs> <laughs>